Let's move up the trail some. Yeah, it's up there clinging to the rocks, that bird. That's interesting erosion patterns over there. I'm gonna go take a look. Okay. okay. Good. I need to be got. You need to be got. Okay. Yeah. Look at the desert. I call it regolith. It goes down about 20 feet and then stops and then goes into a different kind of sediment. Look at a band. Yeah. So, I mean, that's, that's how deep it's built up over the hundreds of years or thousands and then it stops. And I bet it's that way all over the valley. Kind of rocks that might be of interest to you. You know what I think? What do you think? I think there's another arroyo on the other side of this this hill we're looking at. Okay. And we're on the far side. Okay, so if we were to go straight across, we could get to it. How about there at the ridge? You could go over there, but you have to climb up. And I'm not sure if you can get across there or not. It looks like some kind of a path. You see it over there? Yeah. You know? Yeah, I see the path there. Let's go. Let's explore. Okay. I see a car over there. Okay. I'm looking at a path that we can catch right over there. Look. Kind of formation to uh, yeah, kind of is to uh, search for fossils, I suppose.
Well, that's one of those dude buggies made for off-road. Yeah, that's an off-road all the way. I bet that thing could get to the top of the mountain. Yeah. You know, I believe if it was any warmer than this, it might be too warm. It's good we hiked today. Okay. 56 degrees, right? Something like that. Because you heat up when you start walking. Yeah. Yes. What'd you find? A barrel cactus, okay. I'm gonna go back over to the path that takes us down. We're not gonna go down the way we came up. <clears throat> it's too steep. So let's go over there and then down. Okay. I did take my jacket off and I want to put it in my bag. It's actually warm when you start walking. Yeah, but it's only 56 out here, 54. Gonna stick it, up it doesn't feel like it, does it? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I see, uh, you see over there, it looks like a rock breaker. It's uh, yeah. to your left. Yeah. It looks like an instrument. Huh. Or an equipment, I should say. Yeah, that's the same arroyo that what comes down here and whips around. Mm -hmm. And goes over there. It whips around. It's the same one. Go around? Probably. Okay. But it's not the same one that we were looking at yesterday. Yeah. We went that or what? Yeah. Well, it's kind of interesting to explore our oils. You want to see what's on top of that ridge? Sure. We're up here already. What's up there? Just a big cliff? Yeah. It's more of a... Interesting. I'm going up further, Chip. Oh, 
I want to make sure. Okay. Oh. Okay. Looks that looks like good, it. doesn't it? Go down? It? Yeah, All it right. looks like it does, doesn't it? All right. Truly does. It does. Once you sidestep this hill, what? I think it's the safest. I'm going to sidestep it. Okay. First of all, I'm going to get my pole out. But I think if you sidestep it, like you would if you were skiing, right. you know what I'm saying? Right. It might be the, the safer way to go down. That's the way I'd do it if I was a skier, is to side, sidestep it. I put my plat my hole down my pole downhill though. I don't think you'll run into any more of these though. Okay. You know what? Mm -hmm. You're crazy old woman. Oh, I'm crazier than you, old man. <laughs> yeah, you are. Every bit, is, every bit is crazy. More animal, maybe a coyote or something. Is it kind of pretty? Yeah. Oh, you know what this is? Willow? Yeah, this look like one of those cypresses by the river. Yeah. Remember? Yeah. Yeah, quite a bit of it. It's kind of soft. It looks like uh, wood on its edge. You notice that? Yeah, it does. Like you cut through a log and it started to dry up. The cattle were getting stuck though. I think these are cattle tracks. Maybe it's still heavy. You want to cross now? Cross where? Oh, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. I get a feeling. That you think it's horses, huh? Not cows? Okay. It looks like a bigger animal than a horse. I mean, look at the tracks. What's that? If you go left, you're going to go to the way you came, which is really not what we want to do. If you want to follow. The trail that you were photographing those people on, I uh -huh. think you want to go this way. All right, let's go this way. That's a plant fossil. It's almost like a creosote. Maybe this creosote has, has been in here for decades. Yeah, maybe. Okay, here's a plant fossil. Interesting. Now that's the ridge we were walking on up there, wasn't it? Yeah. I think so. Actually, go up there and he'll end up. Walking yeah, on the ridge that's there. what I thought. Yeah. So. You see where this will take us at the end. Yeah, it's pretty. It's pretty smooth traveling right here. It's not bad. We're just exploring. Walking uphill. Yeah. And you still need your walking stick. Yeah. Because we're on top of the hill where the chipper is. We're on top of a great big green hill right now. Okay. It, looks, it looks like this had been here for a long time. 
Yeah. Look at the, the uh, steel. Yeah, the steel. Metal pipes. The of the steel. It's ironed out. It's got that red patina to it. What is this tire belonging to? A truck of some sorts. Been here for a while, I'd say. Yeah. Whatever it was, the, the sidewall split. This is what, what that young guy said is a chip or right? Yeah. Or part of one. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's time. Yeah. It's time to go back down the road. Okay. Boy, it sure is easier going down than coming up. You live here in this pretty valley? Yeah. Uh, hey, look, you can see La Cueva from here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but you can see La Cueva. I got you. Yeah. I see La Cueva is right there in the small end of it. Right down at the bottom. See that little thing sticking up? Jetting up. Down towards the bottom? Yep. Yeah. You know, if you're going to come up here and you want to stay close to that trail, yeah. I think the key is to keep going right, keep going right. Everything going right. If there's anything leading to the right, keep going on it. You know, I don't hear any wildlife at all. I'm not hearing any birds, coyotes. The bird over there, yellow in color, he wasn't noisy at all. He was quiet bird. Huh? You know, you, you remember Morgan, right? Right. I think that fence was made out of this was rock. It greener? Yeah. Oh, that's our our fence is more of a gray rock. Yeah, gray, gray pink. It oh. comes from up over the mountain over there. Oh. Uh, I forget the name of that rock place, but it's not coming from here. Looks like a good place to, for bats to live or... Oh. Why are those things that live under bridges? Swiss? Swiss. Yeah, lots of mud, kind of protected, Swiss. Fish white quartz? Yeah, it is, isn't it? Sure looks like it. Sooner or later, you gotta find a way oh, yeah. to get to where you wanna go. I know. It's just a matter of time. I don't know if you call it regolith or what you call it, but it's all rocky 20 feet down or more, and then it goes different soil. It looks like a silt that's been deposited. Yeah. I think it was a much wetter climate, to be honest with you. Yeah, and then it got eroded. It's dry now. This place is giving up its secrets slowly, you know that? Yeah. I mean, just trying to find the right path is... 
There's so many, so many arroyas bleeding into one arroyo. That, hang on a second. This is actually the path that you were taking. And I'm looking at the gate down there. It says dangerous, don't go. Okay. But you go anyhow and you bear to the right and you keep staying to the right. And then that's where you get the arroyo. And that's where you get to that arroyo that's down beneath that trail over there. Well, we're searching for the arroyo you can follow. I do too. Come get to the gate, come down here, I see a trail. Yeah. And just follow the arroyo all the way. Yeah. Well, you can go time, over there. Next time we know. This is an exploration. Yep. down there. Let's go. This looks like a, the dump, the garbage. There might have been a little camping town in here for miners, you know? Yeah. You see a lot of old debris here. What does it say? Foods. It's in Chinese. Operation since 1930, 39 by something folks manufacturing company hmm. and it says something pens rents hmm. but this this looks like old uh, place maybe a dump or something cans sardines cans we can go that way hey, can you get down to the trail yeah i think so Let's go, let's go over here. We'd never find this one. Now we are finding it. <laughs> 